ओके सो इन दिस मेथड वील वी गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट हाउ टू रिकवर अवर की बाई दी हेल्प ऑफ ईसी टू सेशन मैनेजर ओके सो वट इज ईसी टू सेशन मैनेजर so without enable port number 22 we can access our server without enable port number 82 sorry 22 okay so uh, through console itself we can connect i'll show you that i'll go to my virtual machine one and i'll try to connect my virtual machine one so here you can see that we have an option over here session manager right session manager right okay i'll try to connect my virtual machine session manager but what is the error we getting over here? can anyone so we weren't able to connect to your instance common reason for this thing see ssm agent installed on your instance see if you not install ssm agent it will not work so we have to install ssm agent first okay anyway by default amazon linux will be installed ssm agent we no need to worry about that what is the second second problem i am instance profile so what is the role name see suppose if you want to access any session manager so we have to install one or we have to apply one particular role for the virtual machine right what is the ins- uh, role name ssm ssm instance, instance manager instance core right so we have to create that role then we have to attach i'll show you that i'll go to my instance then i'll go to my vm one then uh, select your action security modify iam role so first we have to create a instance role okay because see session manager that's another service so that will come under systems manager but we required a particular role or permission without permission we cannot do anything so i will select create a iam profile and this will be redirect to our iam console okay iam iam uh, in the sense iam in the sense what is it identity and access management okay so here i will create a role uh, go to create a role so select your aws service uh, then go to common uh, use cases ec2 because ec2 is going to use this role right so now we will search ssm okay ssm and here you can see that aws ssm full access and one more role you can see that amazon ssm manager instance code okay if you don't know please write it down amazon ssm managed instance core fifth method through session manager okay so i will select this role only one role okay amazon session manager so i'll come down then i will create this role next so this role i will call it as session manager okay so then now uh, create a role and this is going to create a role for ec2 machine i'll go to my ia okay so i'll refresh this then i will attach that role what is the role name session manager i will select the role then update iam role so now i can see that successfully attached one role if i select vm1 you'll be able to find a uh, role over here what is the role where is the security go to security and you can see that session manager right okay so i'll try to connect my virtual machine connect but still you can see that i'm not able to connect see ah what is the problem reboot or we have to stop and start okay better every time we can stop and start okay so i'll go to my virtual machine then virtual machine select your virtual machine then stop and start okay that is mandatory so sometime when you rebooting your virtual machine that will not affect okay so better you can stop and start that will work so let's see so now it's a stopping straight uh, once it is stopped then i will start it again okay stop it right i'll try to uh, start it again start okay so now it is started you can see that it is started yeah it's a pending state okay see you can see that my vm one is active right Uh, i'll just select my vm then connect uh, then i'll do one thing i will select uh, amazon instance connect then session manager i can see that we have an option over to connect right i will connect my virtual machine so without enable port number 22 we can access without enable port number 22 okay see successfully connected sudo su right so i'll go to cd and ls you can see that all the files are away whatever the files we have right okay So if I uh, disable my port number twenty two, let's see what happen. Terminate. I'll go to my instance again. I'll go to VM. I'll go to security group. I'll select my security group. So inbound rule, you can see that port number twenty two is already enabled, right? 
So delete this rule and save rule. As of now, I don't have any inbound rule. I'll go to my virtual machine, connect. And you can see that successfully connected. I can see sudo su. So this is a secure method. And uh, if your company, if you're getting an interview question like this, so how we can make it secure our AWS account or easy to instance. So we can implement implement session manager. Okay. So without enabling port number 2022, 20, we can access our particular server, right? Okay. So sudo su, I can see that now I'm root. So if I go to my root directory, you'll be able to find uh, my all directories. Okay. So now what I can do here, cd. Then go to home ec2 minus user and dot ssh and authorized key. See, I don't have any files over here, right? I don't have any file. So I'll create a file first. So let me just open dot ssh. I don't have any files. Okay, I have a files over here. Okay, cat authorized key. Okay, I have a file. So let me open this file nano authorized key. Okay, but I don't have any files inside this directory or this file, right? So I'll go to my command prompt again. So I'll create one more file. SSH, then key gen. Okay, I will specify file SSM test. Okay, new SSM test end. And this is going to create one a new key. I'll go to my file. So this will be create one file SSM test. So I'll go with open uh, with I'll select notepad. So copy this key. So go to your server and paste over you. Paste. Right? So control or enter control X. Then, then I'll go to my uh, server again. Sorry, this command prompt. Then SSH minus I. What is the key name? SSM, SSM. test, right? SSM test EC2 minus user uh, at the right. And we have to enter the public IP address, right? So go to instance, select VM1, security. Because if you want to connect from public, we have to enable port number 22. But if you don't want to enable port number 22, then you can connect through session manager as well. So I'll go to, sorry, I'll go to security group, then I will enable port number 22, then I'll try to connect my virtual machine. So go to security group, uh, I will enable my port number 22, add a root, and rule is 22, so I'll select SSH. Custom, anywhere. So you have to give specific IP address, okay? What is your cust uh, public IP address that you have to give over here? So go to EC2, select your instance, VM1, get public IP address and paste over here. Enter. Yes. And it will be connected to server. Okay. Fifth method. It's quite simple. So we need to create a policy policy or role for our virtual machine. That should be EC2 manage its instance code. Then you have to stop and start your virtual machine. Then you have to connect through session manager. So once you connect through session manager, you can connect without enable port number 22. Okay, you have to create a key pair, public key and private key, private key, copy the public key, then you have to paste over there. Okay, then after you can enable port number 22 or uh, you can keep like that, same, no problem. Then you can access the server by the help of this cre uh, newly created key. Any doubt? So we now we learn around uh, five method, right? Five methods, how to recover SSH key by using five methods. Am I right? Any doubt till now? No.